Now, normally a lark's head would have a fixed loop, meaning this is tied off some way, but there's a reason that I'm not um, tying that loop off. So to do the lark's head, I bring my thumb and index finger in and just overlap it. I'll do that another time so that you can kind of see. Thumb and index finger, bring it around and pull my lines through. One more time. Thumb and index finger, bring it around and then pull those lines through. That makes a loop. So this is really good for securing your lines together. We use this in kite boarding, but if you were boating or just needed to secure something, you can tie that off to another knot and that will not slip. But it needs to be under tension. Now there's another way you can make this, especially if you were tying your boat off, because that can be really hard if there's a lot of pressure on it to undo it. It has to be the pressure has to be off for you to be able to undo that knot. So let's say we want to make a, a slip knot for like boating. So I don't know if you saw what I did there, but I just took this bottom one, what's left, brought that up, and included it in. Slide the knot through, cinch it down. And so now, that's under pressure, I can pull this and it'll remove it and then it'll come undone.